There was plenty at stake in Sunday's derby between Lyon and Saint-Étienne. With Lyon keeper Remy Vercoutre out for the rest of the season, 22-year-old Anthony Lopez was thrown in at the deep end for his first Ligue 1 start. League Cup champions Saint-Étienne have only won a single derby since the 94-95 season, but had a chance to leapfrog their historical rivals and take third spot in case of victory. Well, they had an early chance as Brandao pulled across for Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, but he couldn't put enough power on this attempt to trouble Lopez. Well, for Lyon, this game was a chance to keep pace with Marseille, who won on Saturday. And they could have taken the lead when Clement Grenier crossed in for Lissandro Lopez, but Stéphane Ruffier turned the ball behind brilliantly to keep the scores level. Well, Saint-Étienne eventually found a way through in the 29th minute. Johan Moller whipped in a corner and Kurt Zuma headed in his first goal of the season. Well, Le Verre drawing first blood then after Zuma got away from Maxim Gonelon to latch on to Molo's cross. Leon guilty of a little defensive inattention here and Lopez could arguably have done better. Saint-Etienne taking a 1-0 lead into the break then. Remy Gard and Christophe Galtier leading their men out at the start of the second half. Well, the visitors could have made it 2-0 in the 50th minute after a Samuel Umtiti error allowed Brandao to play in Aubameyang. The Gabonese international pulling the ball just wide to the relief of the home fans. Leon looked to hit back a few minutes later as Gaeta Fofana crossed into the area. Zuma cleared but only as far as Steve Malbronk. And after combining with Lissandro and Grunia, Johan Gorkov eventually got into the area. His deflected attempt bringing Leon level. Well, Gorkov hadn't scored since the opening day of the season but broke through the Saint Etienne lines brilliantly here. It was the unfortunate Zuma who put Lever 1 0 up who made the deflection that got the better of Ruffier. One all with 35 minutes to go. And substitute Roman Hamuma could have nicked it for Saint Etienne in the 66th minute. After getting past Bakary Kone, he saw his attempt saved by Lopez. The rivals forced to settle for one all then, which means Leon a third, four points behind Marseille, and two points ahead of Saint Etienne in fourth. 